Hi everyone, welcome to Easy English. Mm -hmm. Today I want to talk about how to make negative sentences. One of the things that I've noticed is students have a difficulty in making negative sentences. They are fine when some sentences already have an auxiliary like am. Um, uh, for example, I'm tired. So they easily make it into a negative, I'm not tired. But when they don't have this helping verb am, they seem to be lost. For example, I believe him. I've heard students making it a negative like this, I'm not believing him. They deliberately put an am there to help them make it into a negative sentence. Now for that, my tip for you is don't worry if there's no am if to help you. Just put a do there. Now this do is a very much ignored verb among many of my students but it's very useful. So put it in whenever you don't have an auxiliary there to help you. Imagine that there's a do there. I do believe you. So always put that mentally there or I do believe him. So when you make it into a negative it would be I don't believe him. When you want to make it into a past tense, the past tense in a positive sentence would be I believed him. But when you want to make it a negative sentence, again imagine the past form of do there. So past form of do is did. I did believe him is the positive statement. So imagine a did there and now it's easier to make it into past form. So it would be I did not believe him. Now when you say it in a contracted form, I didn't believe him. Again, please learn this pronunciation. I didn't believe him. Ignore the T there. Don't make it I didn't believe him. It sounds very odd. So you could just say I didn't believe him. Now don't use the main verb in past form. Just remember that between the two, only one needs to take the past form. The main verb will be in base form. Now let's take one example from irregular verbs. I do keep my books on the shelf every day, but I didn't keep it there yesterday. I kept it on the table instead. If you found this video useful, do like and subscribe to my channel. Stay tuned for more such videos. Bye-bye.